hi welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel welcome back to Rebecca's lifestyle uh, channel um, hi um, it's been rather cold but sunny day um, in the Midlands in the UK um, but I'm hoping everybody's having uh, the best day as they uh, can or have the best day as possible and if you sub uh, please subscribe to my channel it's the red and white subscription button I upload five, five times a week both on my travel and lifestyle channel also if you press uh, my join button um, you can join my memberships from 99 pence a month and you get extra perks so um today's vlog is travel news uk five latest amazing facts april 2021 part one so um there are various sources um that i found out these facts um which is again really good um over the internet so i'm going to fire away with number one which is sky news covid19 foreign holiday announcement in uh, coming days uh, but pm warns uk to be realistic um which uh, to be fair um we do have to be realistic um in regards to foreign holidays this year um so i do agree with that um, moving on um again to skynews.com covid news live latest uk updates as boris johnson makes an announcement on foreign travel um and contravirus lockdown roadmap boris Johnson confirms on the 12th of April reopening of outdoor hospitality uh, sector which is like um, apartment well like campsites and caravans and um, hairdressers and also non-essential non retail um, as well um such as shops so which is really good news also uh, non-essential retail in scotland opens today so yay so it's something to really look forward to and um, obviously if you're living in scotland then non-essential retail opens today so that's a lot of good news to look forward to um, number three, uh, travel news uh, latest um, from uh, www.thetelegraph.co.uk is um, uncertainty over holidays abroad but um, staycations are going through the roof for summer holidays in the UK so which is um, again really good news especially for um at the UK because um it gives again um chance uh, for UK which is really good news uh, for resorts such as um in the south of England Brighton Weymouth um Eastbourne and also um in Wales um resorts such as uh, Cardiff, Swansea, Tenby, Landud, now Aberystwyth and in Scotland um, cities such as Edinburgh and the Highlands um, and Glasgow also in uh, Lancashire, Blackpool, um, the east of Lincolnshire, Stegs Nest um, and Whitby Filey, um, Scarborough in North Yorkshire and uh, just uh, uh, travel in general in the UK um, especially cities such as say Leeds, Sheffield, London, Manchester um, re uh, really good news 
Um, so uh, moving on uh, to www.bbc.co.uk, which uh, are on which countries are on the UK's red list and um, the Middle East, Oman, Qatar, United Arab Emirates, in Africa, Angola, Botswana, Burundi, Cape Verde, Democratic Republic of Congo, Eswatinsi, which was, was Swaziland, Ethiopia, Kenya, Le Les so Malawi, Mozambique, Niamba or Niamibia, Rwanda, Seychelles, Somalia, South Africa, Tanzania, Zambia and Zimbabwe. In Asia, um, it's Bangladesh, Pakistan and the Philippines. South America, Argentina, Bolivia, Brazil, Chile, Colombia, Ecuador, French, Guyana, uh, uh, sorry, French, Guinea, Guyana, uh, Panama, Paraguay, Peru, Suriname, Uruguay, Venezuela, um, and there's also um, can be countries such as France um, that has grow a growing COVID cases and um, unfortunately can be added to, added to the red um, list um, which you'll have to quarantine um, in an hotel coming from one of those countries um but um again la last but not me at least number five robinson appointed chairman of the travel lodge so good luck to robinson uh, for that and travel lodge co uh, company um i would like to say thank you for watching i hope you've had the best day as possible and um, I'll see you tomorrow um, with again travel news worldwide um, the latest facts at June 2000 sorry April 2021 part three so please keep watching and I'll see you all tomorrow and bye for now um, have a good day, have a good night. Thank you, bye.